So the last major change I have made, the last big update in my health journey, I have started shopping Phylate Free. Phylates are hormone disruptors found in everyday consumer products. And in women, higher phylate exposure is linked to early puberty, endometriosis, infertility issues, and shortened pregnancies. So I've been swapping out my products for Phylate Free products. You wanna do a haul? I've been hauling like a mad person. I have a fall athletic clothing haul from Halara. Halara is that go-to brand with all your activewear needs in the comfiest of styles, fabrics, and colors. What's better is that you can save 15% off using code Colleen15. This top is the Cloudful Long Sleeve Thumb Hole Cropped Yoga Sports Top. I got it in black, extra large, and I paired it with the Cloudful High Waisted Back Pocket Solid Full Length Yoga Flare Leggings. These are also in extra large. I wanted to make sure I had a lot of room and comfort and flexibility. The Cloudful fabric is super high quality, so soft. They feel like second skin. Plus they hold me in, smooth my tummy. I could pair them with whatever. These are the Halara Magic Mid-Rise Knit Denim Flare Pants. These were really comfy. They mimic the look of jeans without feeling like jeans. They hug my curves. They're a great length. I'm 5'10", and I'm just able to stretch and move in these. They have five pockets in total, two back pockets and three front pockets. And they also have belt loops. The booty looks great in them, honestly. Now I have the high-waisted wide leg flowy palazzo pants, and these are in cotton. The color is major brown and I got these in the extra large. I really wanted that flowy look. I love how these are comfy, but still gives off that elegant look. This is to show you that Halara could really take you from the gym to enjoying your day out on the town. This could easily just be paired with a really nice blouse for a meet up with the girls or friends for lunch. I love these. Switching up the top on ya, I got the Cloudful Unic Backless Racer Cut Cropped Yoga Tank Top. This is one of my favorite pieces. This is in the color Turbulence. I got a size large and this is just such a cute piece. I would absolutely collect all the colors like Pokemon. It's so flattering. I love a halter neck style. The cutout back is amazing wear this to the gym wear it out on the street and the great thing about halara is that they have extended sizes so you can go from an extra small to a 3x all in one shop no one is excluded the high-waisted button multiple pockets straight leg casual pants this actually wasn't my favorite i think i got a size too big i got these in the deep red gray and extra large I'll definitely wear them to work. I have a pretty active job where I need to move and stretch a lot, but wasn't the most flattering on me. Halara does the Cloudful fabric so amazing. This is their high-waisted drawstring full-length joggers. This color is in Gull, and this is the extra large. I love a good roomy jogger. Two of my favorite pieces I have on. This is the go-to gym outfit. I will wear to body pump. I will wear to yoga. I could wear it to my home gym. I love this pairing. The colors are beautiful and the fabric is so soft and stretchy and comfortable. And these pants actually have three pockets, two side pockets and a little hidden mini pocket. I feel so heavenly. And guess what? If you're looking for outerwear, Halara's got you covered there too. This is the hooded drawstring plus size casual jacket. Yes, this is plus sized because I wanted a cool casual oversized fit. The colors are what drew me in and I paired it with the mid-rise drawstring cargo joggers. The color is decadent chocolate and they are extra large and the jacket is in red gray plaid the 1x size i can't think of any cooler outfit for the fall the burgundy has just been my it color and it comes with a hood it's long enough for my long limbs if you love these pieces 
The links will be down below in the description box. And to save 15% off your order from Halara, use code Colleen15. Thank you to Halara for sponsoring this video and giving the girls comfortable and cute activewear pieces to wear this fall. Um, I went to Target and I did some damage. Okay, some damage. No guilt. No guilt because this is for my health. So if you are experiencing PCOS, endometriosis, fibroids, hormonal imbalances, hair on the face, you might want to check your body care products um, and start getting phthalate free products okay what should i start what should i start the couple of makeup products that i have this is the essence mascara essence is phthalate free it's also vegan so if you see any essence mascaras they're phthalate free all elf products are phthalate free this is a shine lipstick in the color happy mm -hmm. all elf products are phthalate free okay let's move on to skincare i picked up Undefined Beauty on clearance. So I picked up the R&B Gentle Cleanser. It went from $24 to $7.20. Aloe, niacinamide, and green tea. And this entire brand's products are phthalate free. And I tried it and went back for more because this stuff is good and it's being clearanced. So I was like, why not? I loved it. I also picked up their r and r day serum by undefined beauty so this is female founded plant-based inclusive clean formula sustainably sourced lab tested cruelty free black owned no bs no parabens silicone sulfates palm oil phthalates artificial dyes triclosan tricarbon mineral oil or petroleum if that ain't free i don't know what is and once again this is their day serum look how big that is that is a generous size it went from $28 to $8.40. This is for hyperpigmentation, brightening, and pore refining. Loved it. This is their night serum. And this went from $28 to $8.40. And I picked up two of their gel creams. And this went from $28 to $14. I have sensitive skin, and so this is sensitive skin friendly because I tried it a couple times and I was waiting for the hives to, I was waiting for the breakout in hives and it never happened. So I also picked up this Naturium. This Naturium BHA liquid exfoliant, 2% exfoliant. I have had Paula's Choice, the 2% exfoliant in the past. If you want Paula's Choice equivalent from Target, this is the product. This is the product. This had my, my pores so smooth the night after I used it. My nose just, the cheek air, I was so impressed. And the funny thing is this was the last one on the shelf. So y'all know something I didn't. If you want a Paula's Choice dupe, the Naturium BHA Liquid Exfoliant, chef's kiss and this is a clean product i can't over exfoliate but like twice a week i will use this at nighttime. i this is this is going to be a staple now for oral care i picked up this made by dentist toothpaste this was literally the only toothpaste i saw that was phthalate free so this is the whitening toothpaste fresh mint flavor. This was $8. I'm gonna look for more phthalate free toothpaste to see, but this was the only one I saw. This is TheraBreath um, Anti-Cavity Oral Rinse. This helps fight cavities for 24 hours, strengthens teeth, enamel, freshens breath. This has fluoride in it which is good for preventing cavities. So I know like fluoride is demonized, but um, if you want to fight cavities, you need fluoride. But if you don't want fluoride, I think they have a fluoride free one. It neutralizes bad breath. It neutralizes, it doesn't cover, it neutralizes bad breath. I love Thera Breath and I've been talking about it on fasting journeys forever. So as far as feminine care, Cora Comfort Fit Tampon Multi-Pack. I'm a big woman, I'm 5'10 and I bleed heavy. So I got the Super and Super Plus. This comes with a pack of 32. So I get half, super, half, super plus. This is made without pesticides, dioxins, fragrance, and chlorine. It doesn't say phthalate free, which has me worried, but when I checked on 
um, Target's website, it did say it was clean. So I'm gonna believe them. Even if it's not phthalate free completely, um, at least it is 100% organic cotton and um, doesn't have any pesticides in it. So that's good for my internal. Same with this L brand. This is the L brand 100% pure cotton maxi pads i've been rocking with l brand for years now oh it is organic oh it's organic okay that's great it's organic cotton lovely all the ingredients are here that's to show you how transparent they are extra long overnight and my last hygiene upgrade is the Cora wash. This is the Happy Biome wash. I like this. I like this. I was trying Honey Pot. That shit had me itching, y'all. But I tried this Cora a couple times already and I love it. It is so soothing. It's pH balanced, fragrance free, gynecologist tested, and it is phthalate free, paraben free, and sulfate free. So it literally says no phthalates on the bottle. My favorite part is body care. First off, I'm gonna start with the Dr. Bronner's 18 in one pure cast style soap. And this is the rose one. The rose is my favorite scent. My favorite scent is rose, babe. That's my Bajan Rihanna accent. My favorite is my favorite scent. <laughs> what is the matter with me? <laughs> when I tell you this smells good, I love this so much and guess what it lingers on the skin tell me how many body washes you have that lingers on the skin this strips my body squeaky clean okay so if you're looking for hydration it's not from this but if you want to smell good and if you want to get layers of dirt off it's this if you want to wash your floors it's this if you want to wash your laundry it's this if you want to make a hand soap it's this if you want to wash your fruits and vegetables it's this that's why they call it 18 and one you can do multiple things with this and and I haven't purchased this in a minute, but I'm so happy and it is phthalate free. I got this from Marshalls. This was $12.99 um, and in the stores, it's usually like $16. So if you're looking for these, check out Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Next, I picked up this native body wash. This is the cherry and vanilla macaron. This is sulfate free, paraben free, dye free, phthalate free. And it smells so good. Oh cherry goodness cherry goodness so i'm not i'm not new to native body washes but now that i know it's phthalate free i'm going ham just going ham on them so all native products are phthalate free so have at it know that they are clean they are non-toxic and they are safe also all method products at target are phthalate free how did I not have this before? I even have the freaking lotion and I didn't have the body wash. This is the coconut rice milk and shea butter body wash. You know, I picked it up because it's fall. I want it, ooh. Some people don't like this. They're like, it smells savory. Oh, it smells creamy and yummy to me. I love this. It's so nourishing on the skin. It is so softening on the skin. So yeah, all method, all method, their hand wash, their body wash, cleaning products are all phthalate free. As far as scrubs go, all Dr. Teal's is phthalate free. All Dr. Teal's is phthalate free. This is their new scent. This is the Shea Sugar Scrub. I love their Shea Sugars. I love their Shea Sugar Scrubs. I'm no longer purchasing Tree Hut anymore. Um, Dr. Teal's Reign Supreme. If you want the Tree Hut body scrub texture without all the toxins, without all the uh, artificials, Dr. Teal's is your best bet. Not the salt, but the sugar scrub. And this is their new scent, pomegranate and black currant. They just came out with it. Ooh, smells like cherry Kool-Aid. Paraben and phthalate free. And all their products are paraben and phthalate free. I have two more in my shower. Speaking of tree hut, I picked up their Moroccan Rose Shave Oil. Would you believe that their body washes are phthalate free? The shave oils are phthalate free, but the sugar scrubs and the body butters are not phthalate free. So if you love Tree Hut, like I love Tree Hut. I plan on getting the Cinnamon Dolce body wash. It was sold out when I went back. I should have picked it up when I saw it too, but I was like, no, I'll just, and uh, um, I missed out and now it's gone, but I'll check back and see. But their body washes are all phthalate free. So have at it with the body washes and their shave oil. No parabens, no phthalates. I love the shave oil way 
better than any cream. I get better contact between the blade and my skin when I have the oil in between as the conductor of smoothness, okay? Ooh. My favorite is the Tahitian vanilla. Like, that was my favorite one. That is very rosy. For body care, I re-upped on the EOS, everybody's favorite, EOS 24-hour moisture body lotion and the infamous vanilla cashmere scent. Yes, this is the scent that smells like cake, batter, frost, oh God. Oh, This is just what birthday cake smells like. Just straight birthday cake. And it is so, it makes your skin so supple and nourishing. This is the perfect fall winter body lotion, not just scent, but body lotion. It's so <sighs> moisturizing. It's, it's lightweight, but it's like, because it's made with Shea, it just makes your skin supple. Sensitive skin friendly, paraben and phthalate free, gluten, vegan. I believe all EOS products are phthalate free, but I'm not sure, but I'm pretty certain it is. Happy to have this back. I had this, went through it, never repurchased until now because it's phthalate free. Look how cute the bottle is though. I picked up this Heritage Whip Body Cream in the Cherry Amber Scent. It smells very good, I like it. I like the texture. It's a sulfate free, phthalate free, paraben free, silicone free, gluten free, mineral oil free, propylene glycol free, and cruelty free, and it's vegan. I got it to go with, you know, we have a little cherry going on here. You know what else I wanna get? I really wanted to get with this combo, the um, Finery Not Another Cherry Perfume, which I wanna let you know that all of Target's like perfumes are phthalate free. Good Chemistry, Finery, Mix Bar, Pacifica are all phthalate free. So I wanna get the Finery Not Another Cherry for this combo, this cherry combo. Ooh. So yeah, Heritage is phthalate free. Also TBH is phthalate free. So I got the, I got softer than no other butter. This is a body butter and the vanilla and tuberose scent. Oh, when I tell you this is rich, this is literally like, you know the um, cocoa butter in the jar? It's like this, it's thick. Like this is for your heels, this is for your elbows, those knees. This is like for boo butter, like prevent stretch mark kind of butter. Like this isn't a cream, this is butter for real. And it is phthalate free. Made with shea and moringa oil, cruelty free. I also have her um, body oil and I love the scent. I I, this is that body oil is a forever repurchase forever repurchase and the vanilla and tuberose scent I got some new phthalate free deodorants this is the arm and hammer essentials it is aluminum free but also phthalate free there's a lot of aluminum free products but not phthalate free so this was one of none that I saw in the store. I had to research before I even went to the store to make sure there were even any that existed. This was one of them. This is in the coconut and geranium scent and it's kind of fresh and sweet and I like it. It's like um, almost like a clear gel. You have to make sure your armpits are dry before using this, but I like it. I'm gonna tell you the one I love. I bought the Lumi. I bought the Lumi whole body deodorant. This shit is $15. It is $15 for this stick of deodorant. It's basically their cream, their tube cream put into this, but there's something a little different about it that makes it like better for underarm application. This is, okay, so the whole thing is the scent. Mind you, it's, it's phthalate free and all their products are phthalate free, including their body washes and butters. They have an acidified butter, which is great for shaving. It's phthalate free. This is in the toasted coconut. As like I said, their, their scents are weird to me, but this toasted coconut, if you are a gourmand lover, it smells toasted, but it smells like toasted coconut cream. So it's like vanilla coconut. I love, I friggin', I friggin' love this. It smells so good, and as soon as it like dries down, you know you're protected. Like it feels like it's protecting you. Here's the thing about deodorant, right? And, and excretion. Excretion, humans have multiple ways to excrete right we urinate we defecate and we sweat in a previous vlog i told you to check your armpits to see if you have a puff or a pit if you have a pit you're doing well that means you're excreting properly if you have a puff that means your lymph nodes are blocked up the drainage isn't happening and that's not good because you're supposed to get rid of waste and that's where the aluminum free 
movement came on because we're so we're meant to sweat like aluminum is the antiperspirant but we're supposed to perspire i know it's not cute you cannot stop what the body was meant to do because it doesn't go with your silk shirt like it's it doesn't work that way the silk shirt won't last forever if you're dead somebody in the comments told me a great way to start the detox process um, as far as switching from aluminum to non-aluminum is to get the aztec clay bentonite clay or any bentonite clay and mix it with apple cider vinegar put it under your armpits like a mask and let it draw out what it needs to draw out and then you could start maybe a couple times do that throughout the week and then start your aluminum free journey you're meant to perspire under your armpits don't block up those lymph nodes all right that was my spiel but this should smell good as far as fall winter the toasted coconut is doing it and doing it and doing it wow little fragrance oil i picked up was the french this smells so good i like to wear this at night this is the joy and bliss solar floor glow on perfume oil i'm going to start really stocking up on perfume oils in my arsenal because i just sometimes i just want to smell great without smelling like perfume especially like you know when i'm going out perfume oils are the gr like a great way to mix your body chemistry with a fragrance also i've been checking out um perfume houses that are phthalate free so let me tell you the ones that i found so far okja the perfumery with the perfume oils are phthalate free as i mentioned the perfumes at target are phthalate free so i love this this smells it smells so good it's sweet floral it does have a solar note in it i can smell the solar like almost like um a, almost like a coconut but it's not like super tropical and i've plugged out all my bath and body works plugins and i'm switching over to glade glade is phthalate free glade is made without phthalates formaldehyde nitro musk or artificial colors or dyes and this is what i'm going to be scenting my house with glade not airwick airwick is not phthalate free but glade is this is the share vanilla embrace it is getting cooler so i want my house to feel cozy and a good way to do that is with like a vanilla scent also got the plugs for this so now that i did this haul i can go ahead and get this party started so that is my phthalate free haul i'm super excited to shop with purpose now here's the thing there's there's way too many options in these stores so if i'm able to take away my options and be like i don't buy things with phthalates then it kind of like just narrows my scope i know what to look for what not to look for it now when you're you got it sometimes in this day and age we have too many options narrowing it down is actually freeing just like fasting if i ain't gotta eat i don't have to think about eating <laughs> it's a win-win for me i'm i'm super happy i'm super happy and i hope you enjoyed this phthalate free haul be healthier live longer and um, surround myself with goodness all around inside and out and if you enjoyed please click the like button to let youtube know that you enjoyed this content all right guys i'll see you in the next one Bye bye